All right, so I want to make this uh, small mini series about the, the Cyberface lookup tool. So this one is for 2K18. You can see I have it pulled up here on my screen. I'm going to do a quick run through of the tool, kind of show you guys what it's capable of. So when I push full list, as you can see, here, it comes up with a list of the cyber faces and the actual cyber face file. So as you can see here, like got Ray Allen face 0013. And so what I'm going to do is I'm going to use a different tool to actually assign the face because the cyber face lookup tool is just a tool to it's just a tool that tells you which file to use to get a certain player's face to show. So let's go to another player. Let's see Vince Carter. So face 0110.if. So if I go back to Limnono Trainer, all I have to do is just type in 110. You don't have to use the the leading zeros, the first uh, initial zeros. And so as you can see now, turn that player into Vince Carter with his cyber face. Um, let's do another player. Allen Iverson, you can see he has face 0005. So I'm going to use Luna no trainer. All I have to do is just type in five, go back down. And there we go. Now it's Allen Iverson cyber face. So the cyber face lookup tool is really handy if you just want to quickly look up um, to see what a player's face ID is. So I'm scrolling around. As you can see here, I have a name that's messed up. So like I, I click it and click assign and like I can go in here and I can correct the name or if I have a modded face, I can replace that name. But yeah, you can you can edit this database and also you can search for players. So watch, I'm going to search for I'm going to go ahead and search for Kevin Garnett. And then it'll come up and it'll tell you what his cyber face ID is. So like if I just search for Kevin, it'll come up with a bunch of stuff for whatever reason. I have some Chinese symbols, but whatever. Um, but yeah, this is just a quick overview of how to use this tool. Again, this tool does not actually assign faces, but it, it kind of keeps it's like um, it's not a spreadsheet, but it's a database. It keeps track of all your cyber faces for you. So uh, like that, I was just viewing all the open slots so I could replace like the players. Well, I could replace the faces that are not really real players. If I want to use those IDs for cyber face mods, then I could. Again, this video here is just a quick overview. I'm going to have some more videos with this tool. Uh, I won't have the link to this tool in this video because I'm going to have another video that is going to show you how to download and get started with the tool. All right. So I figured what better time than now to just go ahead and make a few videos because I haven't really been making videos. I took a break. I've been traveling, been uh, in a real basketball league. So, um, yeah, I felt it was time. Again, this is just a quick overview of the Cyberface lookup tool. I'm going to have, I'll probably try to do two more videos. So, um, about this tool anyway. So, We'll see. Just stay tuned. I will have another video showing you how to download and install that tool. All right. All right.